Hey guys. So I've started fabrication on the robot. I have a lot of stuff going on here. Let me just switch this around and I'll show you what's what's the do. I've got a script running right here that's telling my little setup here to read the two potentiometers uh, on the EZB to feed into the uh, servos that are powering this thing. So I'll just see if I can get everything in the shot here. Here we go. And I grab the potentiometer and this is the vertical servo. And this one's the horizontal servo. I guess proof of concept, uh, it appears to be working quite well. I'll, uh, I'll show you the setup I have in the back here. Okay, so here's the back of the mechanism. I just have like this little sort of cross brace here that's driving the horizontal and the vertical. And this is the, the gyro bowl gimbal that I got from Walmart. So get down here there we go so you can kind of see what's going on here it's pulling up and down on on the vertical axis and on the horizontal axis so that's pretty cool the design needs some definite refinement I've just been super gluing popsicle sticks into place to make a frame for this stuff uh, the servos need to be centered properly because, uh, well, I guess the the horizontal servo is kind of off kilter. Kind of happy with the way it's turning out. Let's turn this thing around. It's a minimal of uh, of parts right now. I mean, I have uh, the easy board. Uh, all of the motion in this thing is going to be done programmatically. This here is just for testing. And the ball just basically fits on the back like this. So, you know, with a little bit of tweaking and poking around, I should be able to get it to fit quite nicely. Then I'll spackle it and paint it and have it look all futury. But uh, for now, it's just a hamster ball with a bunch of electronics jammed into it. Yeah, cool.